Dear students, in the last session we have defined similarity of triangles. Let us recall that. When two triangles are similar? Yes, the two triangles are similar if and only if the corresponding angles are equal and the corresponding sides are proportional. In other words, two triangles ABC and DF are similar if angle A equal to angle D, angle B equal to angle E, then angle C is equal to angle F. And also AB by DE equal to BC by EF equal to CA by FA. In such case, we can write triangle ABC similar to triangle DEF. So for the checking of similarity of triangles, do we have to check all six parts? Do we have to check all three angles and three sides? No, you don't have to check everything. There is a shortcut criteria. So now we have to discuss about three important criteria of similarity of triangles. So please look at this carefully. Let's first talk about the AAA similarity criteria. Consider triangle ABC and triangle PQR. Are they satisfying AAA criteria? Are they similar? Yes, because their corresponding angles are equal. Angle A equal to angle P equal to 60 degree. Angle B equal to angle Q equal to 80 degree. Angle C is equal to angle R equal to 40 degree. So using AAA similarity criteria, triangle ABC similar to triangle PQR. So AAA similarity criteria states that if in two triangles corresponding angles are equal, then their corresponding sides are in the same ratio. Hence the triangles are similar. Also, if two angles of a triangle are equal to two angles of another triangle, then the two triangles are also similar. By the angle sum property of triangle, the third angle will also be equal. So, we can use instead of AAA similarity criteria, AA similarity criteria also. Next, talk about SSS criteria. And please don't confuse this with the SSS congruency criteria. SSS congruency criteria means the sides have to exactly equal. While SSS similarity criteria says that the corresponding sides are in the same ratio. Consider triangle ABC and triangle PQR. In this AB by PQ equal to 2 by 3. BC by QR equal to 2 by 3. Also CA by RP equal to 2 by 3. So here the corresponding sides are in the same ratio. So, by using SSS criteria, triangle ABC similar to triangle PQR. So, SSS criteria states that if in two triangles corresponding sides are in the same ratio, then their corresponding angles are equal. Hence, the triangles are similar. Now, we are discussing about MCQs from the topic. Question number 1. Triangle LMN similar to triangle XYZ. What is the length of yx? Options are given. So choose the correct option. Here they mention triangle LMN similar to triangle XYZ. So their corresponding sides are proportional. LM divided by XY equal to MN by YZ equal to LN divided by XZ. Substitute the values and cross multiply after you will get the length of yx that is 6 feet. So the correct option is option D. Question number 2. If in two triangles ABC and PQR, AB by RQ equal to BC by QP equal to CA by PR, then choose the correct option. Here the sides are proportional, so then you have to find out which vertices are equal. Angle A equal to angle R, angle B equal to angle Q, angle C is equal to angle P. So now choose the correct option. So the option is, correct option is option B. Triangle CBA similar to triangle PQR. Study question. Mohit and his friend Rohit went to a tourist place for holiday and saw some monuments. On their visit to this place, they saw a tower and were curious to calculate the height of a tower. They placed a mirror at some distance from the tower and they tried to find the height of a tower. Mohit, whose height was 5 feet, stood at a distance of 8 feet from the mirror. 
and Mohit placed the mirror at the point so that the distance between the base of the mirror and the tower is 24 feet. So here, based on this situation, we have some questions. Question number 1. Which similarity criteria can be seen in this case? So from the figure, easily you can choose a correct option. Correct option is option A. A A similarity criteria. Question number 2. The height of a tower is? So these triangles are similar. So you can use the concept corresponding sides are proportional. So here 5 by 8 equal to H by 24. Cross multiply the value of H is 15 feet. So the correct option is option D. Question number 3. If angle PAB equal to 35 degree, then the measure of angle QPR. Here, the two triangles are similar. That means their corresponding angles are equal. So the correct option is option A, 35 degree. Question number 4. The ratio of PB by BR is? Here, the length are given. So, you can substitute the value. So, PB by BR equal to 8 by 32. That is 1 by 4. Then the ratio is 1 is to 4. So, the correct option is option A. Thank you. Thank you for watching my video.